All right, it's a beautiful Friday evening. Welcome to the podcast. My name is Carlos. And I'm Marga. And, and we're taking over Ricky Baizas, who's currently in Switzerland. Shout out to the Purple Cows right there. We have the guys over from Zolora here, Mr. Miguel, Paolo Campos and Miss Erica Tapalia. Good evening, guys. Good evening. Nice to be here, guys. So, so what exactly is Zolora? Uh, Zolora is an ultimate online shopping destination. Um, what we really want to provide the customer is an end-to-end shopping experience where you know they only see Zalora. They see Zalora, at, you know, in terms of choosing the product, uh, fulfilling the order, uh, the payment, customer service returns. Um, to really provide that on that easy shopping experience, uh, online shopping made easy. The whole yeah. idea behind Zalora is you know all the preconceived notions about e-commerce and things that have been holding it back in some sense, you know, the perception that it's not safe, um, the limited payment options, uh, the fact that you have to pay extra for delivery. You know, if you think about what we're trying to do is systematically address all of those point by point uh, so that uh, to give customers, you know, there's no reason not to try it, you know, why not? Um, It's just like without the hassle of going to the mall or going to the store, you get the product free at your doorstep uh, without leaving the comfort of your home. <laughs> you know, um, for the past couple of years, um, group buying has been the rage in the local e-commerce scene. What made you guys go for a rather more conventional um, setup? Exactly. Uh, yeah, it's more of a you know, traditional full yes. full service e-commerce retailer. Um, I think a couple of things. One is that. Uh, people were really buying fashion, buying fashion online anyway. Mm-hmm. Uh, whether it's through social networking sites, you know, people just sim- simple as people posting products to buy on Facebook mm-hmm. or on Multiply, um, or you know, people are already doing that. And you know, that process is kind of it's a little bit, little bit can be stressful. Or it's not as uh, it's messy. Uh, it's it's messy. a little bit messy, mm-hmm. you know, with the meetups and all yeah. of that. Uh, but people, but even then, people still do it. Mm-hmm. Um, the other option is that you can buy online in the US, you buy from like a shop yeah, or an Amazon in the anything. US and have it shipped over yeah. here. Um, but then you have to either wait for the delivery, pay extra for the delivery. Um, so it's not exactly an optimal experience. This way, mm-hmm. you know, delivered within three hours if you're in Metro Manila at your doorstep. Uh, next day, one to two days nationwide. Okay, uh, um, did I hear just that right? Yeah. Three hours within yes. Metro Manila. Seriously? Within Metro Manila. Within Metro oh, yeah. Manila. Three, three hours. hours. Wow. Yes, three hours. Yeah, so we have our own we fleet of riders. We have dedicated delivery service. Exactly. Yes. So within wow. Metro Manila, we have our own fleet of Zalora riders. Um, and that's how we're able to offer three hour delivery as well as the cash and delivery option for that's Metro awesome. Manila. awesome. Because I'm envisioning this like for the business people actually uh, in, in the offices and in, in, in the industry. Because most of the, our audience are actually uh, advertising people yeah. and, and in the digital scene. So if you mess up your suit and you have a meeting at, let's say, 5 o'clock and you mess it up for over lunch, you don't need to go home. Exactly. No. Mm-hmm. exactly. I need to call, uh, go online, yeah. go online. Mm-hmm. And, and, and order a suit or order a jacket or a, a shirt. A couple of hours. Three it's hours. Right at your office. It's your office. Exactly. Awesome. Okay. Or if you have a party that yeah. night. Yeah, you, you have a party. For Marka. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I see this oriented towards the ladies, I think, more. <laughs> no, you'd be surprised though. Uh, oh, I think ladies. Than... What ladies like about it is the range of products that we have. Range of products. We have lots of different products. Not only the stuff you find in the mall, but we also carry smaller brands that uh, you might not have heard about that maybe you sell at bazaars mm-hmm. or only oh, available awesome. online. Okay. So we're really bringing uh, make bringing all these different brands under to consign and with you guys. Okay, so it's exactly. an, you're, you're aggregating not only big brands exactly. but yes. as well as the little brands. Exactly. Mm-hmm. And we're, we're very proud of bazaars. some of the local independent brands. They have really nice they're stuff. Doing well. um, they're doing very well. Wow. Good price point. Um, and we're just we just uh, with a platform that allows these brands to have, you know, nationwide reach. Um, so yeah, so we're, we're the past couple of months you guys have been operational. What's your most mabenta category? Um, I think it's a seasonal thing. So swimwear is done swimwear very well. Uh-huh. It's summer. Swimwear. It's summer. It's summer. Um, yeah, so we have very strong uh, swimwear Shoes. section. Shoes. Shoes um, also. Hey, my very important question: Do you guys have a size eleven? Size For eleven, women? we do. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And actually, when you go on the site, you can actually filter by size. Because one of the frustrating wow. things is like you see a shoe you like, but when you click no, on no, it, no, it's no, it's no size, right? So this My one. credit card's going to be so cold. Wow, exactly. That is summer. So this way you don't feel <laughs> constrained. You click size 11, and all our shoes are size 11. So I, I gotta do this. I gotta do this, Marga. So uh, you wanna compare your hands to, to Paolo? <laughs> <laughs> this is you. Go for it. 
Oh, oh wow. man. Oh wow. Do you just see chat? Oh wow. That's a huge as well. Yeah. <laughs> right, Miguel? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Now that we got that over, okay. <laughs> Once you pick something that you like yes. and and you get it delivered. Yes. Uh, the problem with, with clothes, right? Sometimes it just doesn't fit. Yeah, clothes and shoes. Yeah, sure. sure. or, sure. or it just doesn't look good on you. Yep. What can, am I? Am I able to? Return? And again, this is a, you know one of the things that you, when you talk about it, it's uh, reasons people didn't shop online before. Mm-hmm. You know, these are exactly. one of the reasons yeah. because if it doesn't fit, then what mm-hmm. are you gonna do, right? Uh, but with us, we have a 30 day return policy actually. 30 day return. Um, yeah. So as long as you haven't wow. used the product, mm-hmm. you can swap it out for a different size for a different product. Mm-hmm. Um, whatever you like to do, uh, so that really alleviates some of the fear that you know I'm not exactly sure about the measurement if my size is exactly. correct. Do you have a universal um, measurement system for all of your? We do. Uh, so we follow the branding provided by the brands, yes. but what we have is a size conversion chart oh, on the wow. site. Uh, so what you we'll see is that you know if it's an uh, international brand, five, exactly mm-hmm. the European mm-hmm. size like or something, mm-hmm. you can translate that into what awesome. we're more used okay. to. Okay, so so I return. So where do I bring it? Do I bring it? Do I? Uh, no, so office. so if it's in Metro Manila, you just give us a call. So in either case, you give us a call uh-huh. uh, just to say that you'd like to exchange okay. a product. Mm-hmm. If it's within Metro Manila, one of our riders will we'll come over. Uh, oh, we'll wow. pick it up. Okay. Uh, if you have told us already the item you want, we'll swap we'll it swap out on the spot. Um, for provincial orders, they can take it to any LBC. Um, oh, and so the, and it will be shipped at our cost to, to Zalora. back to Zalora. Wow. Yeah. So free return, so free delivery and wow. free return. Yeah, okay. So there's no restocking. No right? restocking. Wow. It's no perfect returns. for lazy ass shoppers. Yeah, right? exactly. Yeah. No, because I, the way I see it, right, uh, Manila is getting more congested every day. Uh, the amount of gas it takes yeah. for you to go to a mall yeah. and parking is horrible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So instead of having to go to, to like uh, to a mall, yeah. all you have to do is go online, mm-hmm. get your clothes, mm-hmm. yeah. wear, get it out, and wear it at night. Yeah. Okay. Um. I don't know if other women like me exist, but um. I don't like shopping. Uh-huh. Uh huh. In malls because um it takes a lot of time and I'm really tamad to go through all the clothes. Exactly. So um I think this is perfect for people who don't just don't have the time. Right? Yeah, who I mean, don't have the time. Yeah, or and you might be to, maybe you yeah. work in a call center and you know yeah. you're working all day, you just want to rest, you don't really have time to go to the mall, busy executive um you know there's a, there's a whole convenience aspect to it uh in addition to the wide range of products and definitely you'll find something that you like but the convenience aspect is there too uh, both in terms of the payments the delivery yeah. no need to pay for gas no need to pay for parking exactly. uh, which can add up so, okay. and not just that I'd like to add like the customer service also we have like stylists we have so stylists. you can actually oh, ask my. Uh, yeah so Marga you can ask okay. like if this looks good on you what do you think mm-hmm. you know what I mean like products as well Okay, I didn't know that Solar had style. Yeah, we did. I know. Not Something like, well, hey, yeah. um, I have really broad shoulders. They think this will look yeah, good. Yeah, no, they will answer. Totally do that. Yeah. Fantastic. And we have interns from some of the fashions, local fashion schools working wow. with us. Um, and they can. So, what often happens is we have a chat dialogue in the box. My credit so card company is so kawawa, yeah, Carlos. And people type in the chat dialogue, like, you know, I don't bag it. So, it's really a, a whole experience. Exactly. It's not only shopping, per se, but it's bringing the whole experience of. Having your friends come with Fashion you, advice. Shopping, yes. Fashion and advice, ask yes. them, trying it on. Yeah. Oh, a lot of boyfriends will love this set. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> because they and don't Mother's have to get and the drags around. around. And Mother's Day, oh, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It's a so perfect you, way to send gifts yeah. as well. To your mom, mm. to your, your mom. mom. She will never expect this guy, writer, bring her. Yeah, and oh, when you, if you see our packaging, it, you'll see it really looks like a gift. I mean, oh, wow. whether you're buying it for yourself or for someone else, especially. So yeah. does it come in the box of the brand? Yeah. So no. we have a Zalora box. Zalora box. Oh, Zalora, Zalora box. Not the brand. But the brand will be inside. Inside, yeah. So you have, if you bought multiple products, you have all the packaging in a big Zalora box. Speaking of brands, what are your blue chip um or flagship brands? The way we think about our brands is. Um, we have a mix of international brands yes. as well as both local and international. Local and inter- international. Um, in terms of international brands, we have the likes of Nike on the side, mm-hmm. uh, Asics, um, Brooks. Um, Perfect of, for the running fan. Yeah, a lot mm-hmm. of others. Um, local brands, though, which we're very proud of, is we have a mix of not only the established local brands such as Folded and Hung, mm-hmm. uh, Bio, Planes and Prints, oh, wow. oh. um, but also some of the more, as I was saying earlier, the more independent brands. What do you call it? Um, you know, they might have one or two boutiques uh, in, in Manila or a boutique in Cebu or maybe they only sell online before or only sell at bazaars. So these are the types of other brands that you'll also find with us. Wow, um, okay, okay. But to your point earlier about making Zalora more than just, you know, the vision for Zalora is to make it not only a transaction platform where you can, you know, fulfill okay. it and purchase, um, but to really make Zalora 
kind of a voice in the Philippine fashion scene. Oh, okay. um, I think what you find recently is Filipinos are increasingly consuming their fashion news online. Yeah. You know, before you had to buy yeah, all the... Yeah, of fashion bloggers. Exactly. <laughs> before you had to buy all the magazines to see what's in, and, yeah. you know, flip through it. That's how you get your trends and, yeah. uh, you know, find out what's what's in. Um, but exactly, somehow fashion has democratized somehow yes. online. Um, people, you know, there's hundreds of bloggers with um, yeah. with strong following. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it knows very well. He's <laughs> like, yeah, totally. Yeah, it's like, it's like no, it's, I think it, it's, it's more of like uh, everything, everyone can find something for them. Exactly. exactly. Whether it be hipster, evil, exactly, uh, exactly. clean cut, property, or exactly. whatever. That's the nice thing about this because we, because we carry such a broad range of products, you really have you know, something for everyone mm-hmm. and there's niche communities you find within Zalora. Um, I hope there's a yeah, section for or... boring people like me who just go for classics. <laughs> no, classics. We have we have all the classics. Fantastic. Uh, different price points, different different brands. So you have a oh, wide different range price points. Yeah. Different price points. What we we're not a high end brand. Um, okay. we're not we don't sell, you know, very, very expensive things. Okay. Um, we have a wide range of price points. We have some things that are more on the pricier side. Uh, but we're very conscious of uh, you know, wanting to cater to, to, to you know, to, to the everyday, the everyday, everyday, everyday for the you know. Um, so our price points range anywhere. We have products that are you know, 200, 300 pesos for some of the smaller items, accessories, uh, you know, all the way up to three, four, five thousand. Wow, okay. um, not so bad. Yeah. So do do I have order. to have like a minimum order? Or like no, 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 deliveries no, no minimum, like no minimum order. So I can just buy like a pair of. You guys carry Havaianas? We do, we do. Havaianas will be live on the site in oh, the next week awesome. or so. Okay. Uh, we have oh, other... It's perfect uh, for summer. Right? Yeah, exactly. Perfect yeah. for summer. Oh, perfect. Um, I have to go shopping for swimwear also. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Check it out. Check it out. Do you have, uh, okay, so... Wonderlust no, is on your site. Yes. No, no minimum order. order. Uh, uh, no minimum order. So I can just buy anything and just have it delivered right away. You can. Even to the tune of 300 pesos, 400 pesos. 300. We have... Uh, flip flops on the site, three hundred fifty pesos. That's I mean, awesome. You, That's need, awesome. Uh, you know, you broke your pair, and you're in Boracay. Yeah. And, uh, oh, I have it. Yeah. The next day, it'll there's, be there's, it'll there's be a, there. So, a pair for you. Um, so, okay, what's the what's in store for Zalora? Give us a sneak peek of sure. what you guys are Since coming up. Since you guys up. are launching, uh, yeah, very coming up with yeah. it. Sure. Um, so what's next for Zalora? Right now, we have one hundred fifty brands and five thousand products, different styles on the site. Uh, what's next for us is bigger and better. We're going to have close to 20,000 products in the near future. Um, not only the categories which we carry now, which right as of now we have men's apparel, women's apparel, men's shoes, women's shoes, accessories, kids. Mm-hmm. Um, but in the future we'll also carry Home and Living, which will be launching uh, in May. Uh, it's under the Zalora brand. Yeah, yes. So under the Zalora site, um, yeah, under Zalora. Uh, different brands from Home and Living. Okay. Um, beauty, fragrance, uh, so all the categories that you see in a department store. Uh, so we'll have more categories, so more, more, more to offer our customers, uh, deeper price points, and just more and more brands. Uh, for us, we're nothing without the brands that are brands. with us on the site, right? Um, so it's really, you know, the organization is really about uh, finding the right partner brands and getting the best product on the site. Um, you know, doing a lot of marketing, yeah. both online as well as offline, uh, to get people to come to the site. Um, and then fulfilling the order and making sure our customers are happy. Okay. So like you started in you started building the organization in January. In January, yeah. You launched in Feb, end of Feb, yeah. And how many employees do you have? Right so now? as of now, we're up to uh, the, the organization is at 150. 150. Yeah, so it's quite. Uh, it's 150. Yeah, it's, it's, it's big. It's, huh? one, it's one yeah. employee. From it's one employee per brand. It is. It is. It is. It's crazy. Um, okay. the, our ambition is to become a very very large and successful business. Um, we think that the market is there. From the eight, eight weeks that we've you know, been on the Zalora adventure already, you'll see that the results have surpassed even our kind of wildest imaginations. Um, people are really, the demand was, the untapped need was really there. Um, and you know, the way we think about it, there's no reason why we can't become the biggest retailer yeah. in the Philippines, you know, not just online, but you know, anywhere. Um, That's amazing. Yeah, if you think about Amazon in the US mm-hmm. or Zappos, 
the U.S. I mean, these are very, very large uh, businesses, bigger than some of the offline businesses. Just one statistic. You know Neiman Marcus, the yeah, department Neiman store Marcus, in the U.S.? Yeah. Do you know that Neiman Marcus sells more online than they do in all of their department stores combined in the U.S.? Wow. And considering Neiman Marcus is like a very high end, yeah. like high touch so online customer service. Beats, uh, and offline. their online business sells more, they have more revenue from online than they do in all their hundreds of department stores combined. So it's, um, I think it's more just like um, reaching out to the market yeah. and educating them and bridging that gap mm-hmm. and removing that fear of like, you know, oh my gosh, will they hack my account? Yeah, will yeah, they exactly. steal my money from will, my... Will my stuff arrive? Yeah, yeah, will my stuff even come? Yeah. 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 And your question about the group buying sites earlier, yes. I think what you find with the group buying uh, trend is that people are more and more comfortable transacting online. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, the group buying sites have done a good job of educating the market mm-hmm. that actually it is safe to, to put your, give mm-hmm. your credit card details. Um, you know, that you know, if you don't have a credit card, you can do bank deposit, you know, mm-hmm. if it's more convenient for you. Uh, so somehow the market has been educated the last few years. Um, the need is really very there. Cash and delivery. Cash, yeah, exactly. If you don't want to, exactly. Oh, um, and yeah, next month or two months, we, we offer credit card on delivery too. Oh, so, I think, so you know yeah. how yes. on those delivery right. services when they swipe your credit yeah. card that's on the spot? What, what, yeah. what quality is POS. that? Yeah, yeah. POS, POS, exactly. Right, right, by right, point right, of right, sale. Yeah. sale by a POS yes. terminal, exactly. Wow. So that one will be able to offer what we're calling credit card on delivery. So you're, you're not sure you don't want to swipe your credit card or put your yeah. details yeah. Yeah. Put it online. Our writer will come to you and swipe well, your card. Well, I personally had a spot. traumatic experience back in 2008. Yeah. So I'm very hesitant very when it hesitant, comes to, yeah. yes. No, that's because, understandable. Because, if you got burned before, you wouldn't mm-hmm. want to do it again, right? So this okay. one, swipe it on so, the spot. So if, for example, if I'm already like a customer of Zalor yep. and I've done the whole deal, mm-hmm. uh, I got my stuff, mm-hmm. And I just want to keep buying. Yeah. Is it do you keep like a log? Do I keep, keep do I even get an account? Yeah. So what happens uh, upon your first purchase is that you register your your details with us, um, and that now makes the second purchase much smoother because we have all your details, shipping address, so like uh, just yeah. click one click purchase. Um, so that allows you to now. Yeah, keep on buying and buying. Keep and on buying. What our goal is to really make it second nature that when you need something, you know, you're, 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 working, like, you're thinking about yeah. that. You're like, I need a shirt this weekend. First thing you do is check Zalora. Um, you guys have an app? Uh, we will develop one soon. Uh, uh, that's, that's good that's, news. That's, we'll that's what I've been soon. wanting to ask for. Yeah. Um, yeah. But as of now, we're focusing just on, on the desktop yeah. yeah. screen yes, interface. Of course. Mm-hmm. Um, but eventually, well, I mean, mm-hmm. the sky's the limit to the things that we have planned. I could, I could just imagine him in the car and then... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, and buy, buy anywhere, right? Anywhere. Buy anywhere. Mm-hmm. Um, and what, like Erica said earlier, what we really pride ourselves in, selves in is in the customer service. Mm-hmm. Uh, so actually, in every order, um, our customer service agent will call you to confirm the delivery address just mm-hmm. to make sure that, you know, maybe you don't want it in three hours. Maybe you want it... Maybe you know, you're not You're home. not home. You mm-hmm. want to schedule the delivery mm-hmm. next day, 10 a.m. or something. Um, so oh, so you could like schedule those, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Just so what's gonna happen? Home, exactly. Or, or so what's gonna happen office. is once they once you place your order, as the law person will call you, uh, call or text you, um, and confirm the order, make sure that, that, that that's the size that you wanted, um, and then ask for when you want it to be delivered. Um, okay, so yeah. if like for example, if I'm, I'm in a remote place, yeah. like I'm in Palawan somewhere, yeah. mm-hmm. and, and I need a pair of like flip flops. Yeah, for sure. Uh, will it arrive? I mean, do it I will. have to pick it up at like an LBC? No, it will arrive. They will it's find a way. Straight I mean, to their thing, sword? What you'll find is that uh, the third party logistics providers have really. They're, they're really they're pretty good. The, yeah, and if you live in a place that's one of the few places that's so remote that you can't get to, like you would know it. <laughs> you would know it. Uh, but you'll be surprised. I was surprised too that actually they, they you reach. can get to 99% of the country. Wow, 99% yeah, yeah, of the yeah. country. Wow, so that, that's a very yeah, strong yeah. statement. It's true, it's true. Yeah, yeah. I think it's um, they, they, they're capable. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Carlos, when you go shopping, um, what's usually on your wish list? Like tech stuff, right? Tech stuff, yeah. <laughs> no, no, just kidding. But if I usually buy like shoes and shirts mm-hmm. mostly yeah. as guys, right? Yeah. Uh, but for example, is it more catered towards women than the, the line? Not, no, so I would say the product mix is um, probably 70, no, two-thirds women mm-hmm. products, a um, um, little bit less than maybe one-fourth um, for men mm-hmm. and then kids also takes up a certain portion I hope you guys can um, have like do you have like a Sephora type selection so we're gonna have Make beauty very and, soon yeah, so beauty, beauty is one of our new okay categories. I'm so <laughs> like, um, <laughs> what, what we're excited awesome. about beauty is uh, not only the international brands yes. but local you'll find yes, that yes, there's yes. a lot quite yes. a number of up and coming uh, local beauty brands that are um, very high quality and good price point 
I think one of for one one of our goals uh, is to really push the Filipino scene, the local mm, yeah. um, scene retail forward, scene. the retail yes. scene forward. Um, so while we have our international brands, which you know mm. we're very happy to partner with and people want, um, we also it's also in our interest to to give these smaller brands uh, you mm. know that platform that they've been looking for to reach the whole country to, to generate. It's all sales. fair. I mean, they don't, the bigger brands don't get more exposure. Exactly, exactly. Mm-hmm. There's no exactly. But so. what if like okay, I'm talking as a as an entrepreneur right yeah. now. Mm-hmm. If I had like a small brand, yeah. and I didn't have enough like advertising collateral, yeah. how, how and I and I want to advertise in Zalora. Yeah. Of course, like bigger brands will have like these these models and yeah. stuff, right? I don't even have product shots. Yeah. No. So the thing is, everything is done. Our promise to our partner brands is that we take care of everything. So you just send us the product, <laughs> and we okay. do the photo shoots in house. Mm. We do the con- the product descriptions okay. in house. You can provide it to us if you'd like, but if not, we can do the one be the one to write up the description right that up. you okay. see on each of the products. Uh, we have an in house studio at our office, um, so we have on a twelve hour basis we have two product tables going where we <laughs> shoot product shots. We have a apparel studio um, For models with models. So it's it's day. pretty fair. Like if you display all the products. And you just pick based on what you exactly, exactly. appeals to you. It's exactly. not per brand. And the philosophy behind mm-hmm. it is we really want to put the power in the hands of the consumer. Mm-hmm. I mean, the internet is just such a democratizing yeah. force. Mm-hmm. Um, so this way, if you're a big brand, small brand, it's uh, equal whatever country, brand, yes. it's equal, it's, a fair, it's all fair game. And let the consumers decide. Okay, so we've talked about like how do shoppers get in touch with you? Yeah. They just log yes. on to the site, yeah. sign up. Yeah. But as an entrepreneur, as a, sure. as a startup, because I know a lot of the our our, our, our watchers yeah. are probably mm. thinking, oh, I have this idea. How do I like, re- how do I exactly. tap digital do I, yeah, for my do, business? Yeah. How do yes. I tap digital? How do I yep. sell my stuff online? And and I maybe right now that they're selling stuff on Facebook and yeah. they have pictures of it on their bed yeah. or something. Yeah. So how do we dig in touch so with you? So yes. we'd be happy to, I mean, every day you should see our office. Every day there's kind of uh, potential partner brands showing up and uh, so we entertain everyone. Mm-hmm. Um, and again, don't, don't just because you don't see your particular category on the site, so you might have, you know, like a home and living brand where mm-hmm. you do uh, home and living pieces, um, you know, just get in touch with us. Um, we'll explain to you exactly how it works. Um, again, what's ni- what our partner brands like is this is the ideal, the internet is the ideal testing ground. It's a very exactly. fertile exactly. testing ground where you can say, you know, I think this might work. I don't want to necessarily commit to large volumes that mm-hmm. the department stores will demand yes, that you yes. have minimum orders, minimum order quantity of you yeah. know, a very large amount. For us, just give us you know, a, whatever you want to try out, a few, few pieces of each. Mm-hmm. We can put it online, see if it sells. Um, the nice thing about it is, is we can also trace... Um, like if who viewed it, if it was actually oh, wow, you know okay. visited, okay. if the stuff sells more, and we were we yeah, details to them, yeah, yeah, and that's the beauty of and for me in terms of running the business, yeah. uh, compared to other businesses, is that the amount of customer information yeah. available mm-hmm. is it's really unparalleled. Um, you not only see sales of you know with what items were purchased, but of you see free demographic and, and how many people viewed certain products. Um, so we can tell one of our partner brands like you know. A thousand people viewed your product, only a hundred bought. You know, the nine hundred people that didn't view your product, they did they buy something else? Did they buy another brand? Did they buy a cheaper brand? Um, oh, maybe you should tell about the pink shoe story. Yeah. So I mean, oh, what do you okay. find? Big yeah, shoe. Pink shoe story. <laughs> what do you find online? Shoe. So this is actually you know, we have a sister site in Australia, um, and so they were you know sourcing product, mm-hmm. uh, working with one of the partner brands there. Uh, they were looking at the lookbook and picking out which which I. Um, uh, styles will be on, on the website uh, there's this pink shoe um, and then the brand themselves said oh actually no one really buys that pink shoe uh, pro- probably won't sell that mm-hmm. well on the site suggest you don't buy it but then the buyer was like actually no you'd be surprised what people buy online <laughs> uh, it might not yeah. be exactly what people buy in the brick and mortar store mm-hmm. uh, and they put the pink shoe online and it was one of like the best sellers the best the sellers yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, the, other, the other anecdote about e-commerce is uh, uh, one of our sister sites, so Zalora Philippines is part of a network of sister sites around mm-hmm. the world. Uh-huh. Um, the investment group that we partnered with has uh, done something similar in many countries. Uh, so we have these kind of anecdotes and experiences to share. Um, this was in Brazil. In Brazil, um, the buyer for men's shoes uh, signed up Timberland. You know, the yes, yes. Timberland. Yeah. Um, and when he was selecting the product, uh, he said, okay, I want to buy the best, seven mo- best-selling Timberland models, okay. seven styles. So they bought the seven styles, put them on, on online. 
Um, it wasn't selling for some reason. So they, they, why isn't it selling? These are the best selling models. Best selling? Yeah. yeah. So what they did was they then, then put alongside those seven models, uh, 30 other models, uh, Timberland styles, um, alongside the seven. And overnight, the original seven which they thought would sell started flying Funny. off the shelves. So what does that say? It's the, 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 those two stories tell me two things. One is that... Um, you know, it's really about the range of choice. Yeah. Yes. What what online offers you is a really broad selection, because we're not constrained by physical shelf space. Mm-hmm. Unlike if you had a store this big, for example, you'd only be able to carry you know however many how shoes many you can display on the wall yeah. or however many clothes you can carry on the rack. Uh, for us, we're able to carry thousands and thousands and thousands of products. Um, so your that range of choice and that you know, consumer feeling that. He doesn't only have the seven shoes to choose from, but the 30 shoes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, that's what really drives sales. Um, and on the pink shoes, it's that you just be surprised what sells online. Yeah. I think this certain level of comfort and security of being able to shop from, from your home. Mm-hmm. Um, so, so you'll see certain products that wouldn't sell in the brick and mortar stores actually selling online. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, but we'd encourage, to your point about you know, partnering with entrepreneurs yeah. who might be interested in selling through Zalora, we're definitely open to that. Uh, we encourage anyone interested to get in touch with us. Uh, the best way is probably through our customer service uh, email. It's customer at zalora.com.ph. Customer at zalora.com.ph. Uh, so drop us an email and just tell us what your brand is. Schedule a meeting. Or, um, yeah. So it sounds like for the digital marketers listening or, yeah. or watching, uh, it sounds like you have a really good CRM program. Mm-hmm. Yes. And this is actually a very good case study for the long for the long It is. It is. Because you never know what, what, will, what will sell. Exactly. Yeah. And the Timberland story actually shows that what drives the top sellers are actually the comparison. Exactly. With the, with the non-top sellers. Exactly. So it's amazing. It's amazing. Something to learn. I mean, Zalora is doing it. Uh, you might want to partner with them because yeah. they, seem, they, they know what they're doing. Yeah. And what's, I think what sets us apart as well is that we have a very, very well-developed uh, kind of online marketing presence. Mm-hmm. So if you, know, if, you look at, if you look at marketing... The way we think about marketing at Zalora, uh, we really see there being two pillars to our marketing strategy. Um, one is the what you call paid online marketing. Mm-hmm. So this is your Google Ads. Mm-hmm. These are your um, global display network banners that you do through Google as well. Um, these are your Facebook mm-hmm. ads, which uh, are surprisingly very, very, very effective. And just an insight about the Philippine market is that. Uh, as I said, we have partner websites across the world, mm-hmm. and the Facebook ads in the Philippines are mm-hmm. just do pheno- so much mm-hmm. phen- phenomenally better than in any other market, wow. even within Southeast Asia, actually. Uh, so Facebook ads is a significant Facebook. source of traffic. So you have to do all of those things mm-hmm. because that's like you know purchasing advertising yeah. space, getting your name out there. So that's one pillar of the strategy is to to really do that very well, um, and to do that in a way that's in the spirit of kind of A-B testing, mm-hmm. optimization, making sure that the banners you have are being clicked on, the conversion on those banners is high. Um, so the kind of the analytical back end to make yeah. sure that we're really doing, spending every At the right advertising right. Uh, spend, um, you know, cost effectively is, is very important. Uh, you know, the second leg of the marketing is then what we're calling the organic, the organic okay. stuff, you mm-hmm. know. This is social media, getting mm-hmm. people excited to be part of this, the Laura mm-hmm. community. Uh, viral videos, mm-hmm. you know, creating cool content for people to share, um, different, you know, contests like make your own advertorial, um, you know, things like that. Uh, and in addition to top tapping the blogosphere, mm-hmm. uh, you know, so it's really a two pronged approach. Mm-hmm. Get your name out there through the, some of the traditional mm-hmm. paid channels, mm-hmm. uh, online paid channels, uh, but also create some buzz through mm-hmm. through social media, through all you know, through all the tools that the digital marketer has in their toolkit. And coming soon also, um, another way that's unique to Laura mm-hmm. and the company would be your e-zine. But unlike your regular magazine, right? Or whatever. It's going to be you, like some sort of lookbook. So it would be a similar, lookbook yeah. oh, that you can actually, okay. when you click it, you can, it leads to the product page so you can actually get it. This is going to be really, really, really cool. Yeah. <laughs> so this is part it's of awesome. making mm-hmm. Zalora uh, a voice in the industry. Um, so in addition to... Um, the, the traditional way of viewing the product which is kind of you just see the product side by side and you click on the ones you like uh, this will be like an editorialized um, mm. e-magazine basically uh, so we brought on someone on board who's experienced with traditional fashion magazines to be our fashion editor mm. um, and so now you know I, I came from the office and we're 
putting it together and it looks fantastic. fantastic. And oh, one click away. Forward. So it's not like a traditional magazine yeah, where like, oh, no wonder where I can buy this. Yeah. You know, exactly. This one's literally like you're flipping, right flipping online and you're like, oh, wow, I wonder where I can buy this. And yeah. you scroll your mouse over and oh, yeah. I can buy that. Somewhere. I was, I was at that, that, that uh, time wherein people would actually bring magazines to stores and say, mm-hmm. do you have, do you have this? this product? Exactly. Mm-hmm. And, exactly. And, and it's just not happening yeah. anymore. And you guys are bringing that experience yeah. online. It'll yeah. be a bi-monthly release. Oh, wow. release. Okay. So every two weeks. Cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So because that's how fast we can get products as well. So we always have things that are new. New, new stuff. We're new featuring stuff. new new brands that we carry. Mm-hmm. New trends. You know, summer trend, back to school trend, whatever. Okay. So you you mentioned about this organic marketing, yep. right? Mm-hmm. And I'm I'm in the business as well. Right. Yes, you are. We're in, 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 in the blogs yes. here. Uh, I was just wondering because a lot of bloggers have been talking about this this lounge. Yeah. I don't know if I should like mention yeah. it. Sure, sure. Well, what, what is this lounge? It's a secret. <laughs> oh, is this a secret? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah so to our, to our blogger <laughs> friends out there, if you want to be you know one of our partner bloggers, uh, what we have is uh, the Zalora Bloggers Lounge. Uh, so our office is out here in Makati on Jupiter Street. Um, and if you come visit us, what you'll find is uh, it's part Google Plex, part ad agency, part fashion house. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's a pretty cool, yeah, uh, pretty cool, office. yeah, pretty, pretty cool awesome. space. Awesome. Um, and as part of the office, I we have. Hang a, up their office. Yeah, we're, we're, yeah, we're talking to, about it off the yeah, air. Yeah, and you're welcome to come over. <laughs> it's pretty, for pretty sure. awesome. Pretty awesome. Um, we'll give you a spot at the jacuzzi. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Yeah. Well, we're staying at the old spa building in Jupiter, yes. uh, and we've converted one of the spaces there into a, a place where bloggers can come yeah, hang yeah. out, uh, surf the site. Mm-hmm. Um, you get know, styled actually get styled because we have an in-house studio mm-hmm. operating yeah. every day with uh, makeup artists uh, oh, photographers so for instance um, I'm looking at shopping for um, a date night or yeah. an event yeah all I have to do is browse through your pegs or talk to your side hey I'm going to this event exactly. yada 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 exactly. and then the theme is so and so yes you know, something to fit they're this going to theme. pick out everything that you exactly and they're gonna give you suggestions. that's a dream for exactly. fashion dummies yeah, like me in a department store you have your personal shopper yeah, whatever, exactly. whatever you call them mm. right? so for us too we have our in-house fashion and, and it's all via chat right? mm. it can be, it can chat be via or chat or, or, or via, call. via phone oh, wow. okay. uh, so the other thing is um if you're not comfortable placing your order online or mm-hmm. just giving your information online, our customer service agents can walk you walk through. you through the order on, on the phone. So all you have to do is just talk to someone and mm-hmm. they'll do all the work for you. Um, so again, the spirit is to just make it as easy as possible, you know, rather than ask, you know, why shop online? It should be, you know, why not shop online? It's all right. really so easy. You've been in, you've been running it for like eight eight weeks. Eight now. weeks. Eight we've weeks. been live. For eight so weeks. what are what are like? Some of the, the stories you can tell us about just just some insight about yeah. like what's happening in the e commerce scene. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, I think so. One of the things is that uh, Facebook is really kind of gotten to the point where it's just a really prime marketing channel. Oh, okay. um, I mean that might be obvious, but not only the Facebook ads as I mentioned mm-hmm. mentioned earlier, um, but really the uh, the Zalora Philippines page. It's really a venue where people look for product, look for fashion advice. Um, we we feature kind of feature products of the day, um, and that's something that really drives people to site. Um, so what you find is that as a, there's as much as you can provide that fashion advice and handhold your customer yeah. into to what they should be seeing um, with Twitter and, and Facebook. Those are some very very powerful tools mm-hmm. uh, to speak directly to your customer and to have them speak back to you too uh, ask questions about um, you know what 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 will these shoes particular shoes go with what what type of look yeah. um, so just the two way interaction with your customer pro- that social media provides is something that you know might have known already but when you actually see it in action you see the number of people who are just yeah. um, no, you feel the community is very alive and you feel that uh, yeah Facebook and Twitter just really Part of everyday life now it's for really a lot of a lot of people really for a lot of people okay. yeah um, that's one the other is on the uh, I, I was very surprised just how many orders we're able to get in the day to be honest uh, we have we're doing very 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 well um, yeah I mean triple digit orders uh, in a day um, so pleasantly surprised at actually how much we were right that the market is actually there. 
It's amazing. So the, the challenge for us on the operation side is to scale up really quickly yeah. uh, so that we're able to meet that demand and to, to be able to make our customers, keep our customers happy while doing that. All right. Uh, how about, like, what would be the weirdest, I mean, your writers must have, like, tons of stories. Yeah. So <laughs> what could be the weirdest thing that they've encountered, like, delivering maybe those fake shoes to, like, this really more yeah. masculine dude? Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's not weird. That's, like, <laughs> for the course, I would say. Uh, Wait, what uh, crazy stories do you Wednesday. have? Oh, my yeah. God. You could share. Uh, average Wednesday. Yeah, there was one just crazy story that uh, this guy had bought a... Uh, uh, a bikini for, 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 <laughs> his, his, girlfriend. for his girlfriend okay. um, and didn't tell us that it was actually not like he was actually also married at the same time. <gasps> oh! Oh, forgot to tell us Risky. that he's having it delivered to his home <laughs> that his girlfriend obviously does not that, live yeah. in yeah, with yeah. him. Uh, so the writer shows up as as agreed that we called him and they're like, hey, you're going to deliver to your house around this time, okay? He's like, yeah, of course, okay. Dude's not covering his yeah. tracks. And then, he, then the writer showed up at, at their doorstep and uh, the wife answered the door. And then she's like, oh, it's Adora? It's like, oh yeah, this is your husband. I mean, this is this, this is the order name, the invoice. They're like, okay, I guess this is ours. She came inside, opened the product and it was about two or three sizes too small for her. Oh. <laughs> So I don't know what happened anymore. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I already have an alibi. If I were the husband, I would yeah. be like, "Oh, honey, because you know, I, I think you're really sexy." It's exactly, and exactly. Know. Surprisingly, we didn't get we... a return. We didn't uh, get a change. It wasn't, it wasn't, <laughs> yeah, it wasn't the writer came back. He told me like, uh, "Sir, uh, they might want to change the size because it didn't look like it was gonna fit." Her. <laughs> and, uh, but we never got a call. We never heard from them again. <laughs> Okay, okay, so that's one, maybe like... That's beyond uh, the writer's call of duty. Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you gotta save that. Gotta save. Domestic okay. issues. Exactly. <laughs> what about like... Driver's right? cheese miss. I love I know. it. They, they see a lot. <laughs> they see a lot. They would yeah. The other day, um, Mao, well, so, you know, we see oh, yeah. people that order. So, so our customer service was confirming the order and uh, it was in Maui Taylor that called. Wow, so like, okay. Hey, oh, Maui Taylor. You, oh, are you the Maui Taylor? So, oh, yeah. It's like, well, it's your first. I see that it was her second time buying at Zadora. Uh, it's like, oh, you see that you're buying it's Adora. It's, you know, we're wondering if we can, you know, have our writer come over and snap a picture of you, um, <laughs> you know, receiving the package. It's like, oh yeah, sure, just come, come over by before one thirty. And so when the writer showed up, he had this. We armed him with this digital camera, and then he they took, took a, a picture photo. of her uh, <laughs> shopping on the site. Pretty cool, um, it's pretty cool. Yeah, we put it on our Facebook, and. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I think it. I saw that. I think I was yeah. saw that. were having a holding a Zalora box. Yeah, yeah, so whenever the writer goes out, so adventures await, wow. I guess. So. Wow. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, Miguel. I mean, the stories that they would tell. If you guys want to apply to be a writer, <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe give you like a nice Zalora t shirt, helmet. Yeah. Yeah. So snazzy. I think, uh, yeah. Maybe, you could, maybe Miguel's wife could consign. <laughs> yeah, hey, yeah. She's a designer, right? Okay, right? Okay, yeah. We're yeah, going to talk to Miguel for sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, invite invite our viewers to YouTube. Um, we'd like to invite everyone to just check us out. Just see what we're about. Uh, www.solora.com.ph uh, you'll see when you go to the homepage that you can sign up for uh, if you uh, sign up for our newsletter, you can get a 250 peso voucher to start shopping on the site. Just to you know, encourage you to try it out. Um, we send out you know uh, electronic direct uh, newsletters uh, pretty regularly, so you can keep um, up to tabs on what's new uh, with Zalora. Um, and again, we really want to make shop online shopping as easy as possible for 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 you for our customers. Um, so if you're not sure about the size, about anything, just give us a call. You know, you'll find the n- number on the website. And talk to one of our agents and you know, uh, give Zalora a chance. Yeah. All right. Th- well, thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you, Paul. Thank, thank you, you Erica, much. for being here. Uh, it was a really enlightening for us. Um, yeah, and it's going to cost you time for you guys to just log yeah. yeah. on. <laughs> I, think, I, think, exactly. I think you have a new customer. Yeah. All right. <laughs> just glad glad to have Morgan. Yeah, right. I re- my shoe closet is ready to All burst. Right. Exactly. <laughs> Uh, thank you to Beyond the Box for uh, hosting us here. Beyond the Box is the premium Apple reseller here at One Rock Hall. They're open at 24 hours. Am I correct, Miguel? Okay. Oh, on, on, on weekends, weekends. 24 yes. hours on the weekends. If you need so anything for Apple. Tomorrow and nice. Sunday. Yeah. If you need anything, hours. drop by at One Rock Hall. Buy your Apple stuff here. Uh, thank you also to Miguel. The man, Miguel right there. Right. Man with a plan. Uh, and Tony behind the camera. Tony behind the camera. Uh, uh, show yourself, man. Yeah. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. Hey, Tony. Tony. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, my I'm, I'm Carlos. I'm Marga. And the weekend starts, as Ricky said, in five, four, four three. three.